which are 4 mm in diameter. They are used for the skull base surgery and the transpenoidal and also as diagnostic for the PTE or while you are into the ventricular system. They are of different sizes, 0 degree, 30 degree and we have another one which is 70 degree. But the main event which I want to show you, the main endoscope is this one. This is one of the world's smallest endoscope and we are very glad that we have this in the department of King Edward and Mill Hospital. You can imagine the difference in the size of the endoscope. This is just a one millimeter width or a diameter of the endoscope. It can go through the aqueduct, it can go into the smaller, very very small areas. It's also used to place the shunts 
when you use a shunt with it, you call it a shuntoscope. Imagine, now look at the difference in sizes. 1 millimeter, 8 millimeter. A 4 millimeter, 1 millimeter. A 6 millimeter, and a 1 millimeter. Now we we'll use all these and we'll show you how the what sort of images you get on the monitor. Take it.